All right, all right. Armor Frost fans, welcome, welcome back to another video, guys. And guys, what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to be showing you guys how to, uh, like, how to get the big cards on the TLC. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to play it and stuff like that, you know. So this is going to be about, like, how to get, like, all the big cards on TLC, So which is pretty cool. But guys, if you guys do enjoy the video, uh, uh, make sure make sure you guys smash 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 the smash the like button below. Hit the hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. And if little bit, let guys know whenever I post a video. And as always, guys, if you guys like to follow me on Supercard, come on, baby, come on, come on, baby, come on. Just type in uh, Peyton Frost, a lowercase. But remember, if there's a space after after my name, you guys won't be able to find me. But 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 if it's all one word without a space, then then you guys can find me on Supercard. And any any time my name and all lowercase or all uppercase, either way it works. And guys, remember if you guys want to get a quick shot on my channel, just write just write me on Supercard, or you guys can write me on YouTube. But remember, in your YouTube comment, write your Supercard name, so it'll be a lot easier to find you guys. All right, so the first quick shout out is going to be uh, Fire. But yeah, but guys, go check him out on Supercard. He's a he's a fantastic guy, all Supercard player, fantastic friend. Here's his cards. I rate perfect 10, dude. Keep it the fantastic work. Keep being awesome. And here's the team as well. If you guys like to go check it out. Next one is Solo X. But guys, but guys go check him out on Supercard. He's a, he's a fantastic guy. All Supercard player. Fantastic friend. Here's his cards. I rate perfect 10, dude. Keep it the fantastic work. Keep being awesome. And here's the team as well. If you guys like to go check it out. Next one is Accelerated Score. But guys, but guys, go check him out on Supercard. He's a fantastic guy. All Supercard player. Fantastic friend. Here's his cards. I rate Perfect 10, dude. Keep it the fantastic work. Keep being awesome. And here's his team as well. If you guys like to go check it out. All right, guys. So here we go. So as you guys know, with the TLC, of course, you have four matches you can do. And remember, you can actually start all four of them right away. So, and remember, you can just do whatever pattern you want, though. So just letting you guys know. I said, here's how you play for tables, ladders, and chairs. That's how you play it, just to let you guys know if you guys don't know how to play it. It's a really simple game, and it's a lot of fun. We haven't we haven't had the game in a little bit, so if you guys might be new to it, but yeah. And here are the cards that you have from whatever cards you have. Here's the cards you play with. And then you can start all four of these at the same time. So I'm just going to just do like a random pattern here. So we'll just do like that. I'm just going gonna to do like a, like a cool pattern. Uh go here and then let's just go mm, let's go there why not right and then we'll just do the same thing here just to make it more fun i may not win but i can at least try right let's do that okay and then remember you can start off four at the same time Okay, so here's how it's going to work for the. There's a lot of different tactics you can do for this. It's really good. It's like one of the best game modes you can play. It's really good. It's a lot of fun. It's really cool. And remember, whenever you guys do this, whenever your opponents, whenever the match gets done, remember, you can spend 100 credits and get another match. So remember, you can do that. <clears throat> and remember, this also helps out with quests and stuff, which is pretty good if they do have it, you know. So here's the bay. Here's where you want to find all the pieces. You want to go on the outside of the square. You, the four corners are most likely is where the chair is going to be most likely but also you have to find the pattern because you have a three piece you have a one piece and you have a two piece so the best thing i would try to find will be the ladder first or even the chair those are probably be the two main pieces you want to look for so you want to so what you want to do go around the board so if you there if there's nothing there on like the bottom and go here on the side then one at the top and then one on the side because it'll give you an idea of where all the pieces are you know what i mean and sometimes, like I showed you, and let's say the let's say a chair is right here, it could go up, it could go down, it can even go in this way. Or even like a ladder, same thing, go up or it can go sideways. Now for a chair, it can only have one square. See, there was a, I was gonna go to the right, but I kind of clicked the wrong card. That's all right. Now remember, if your card is too if it's if your opponent's card is too strong, like see see how that's too strong? Remember, if your first card gets defeated, remember you can refight him again. But of course, sometimes they can defeat you again, but it makes the card weaker. So it'll, it'll, it gives you a better chance to defeat it, but it also gives them a better chance to find more of the, find more of the card. See, like he just did there. But sometimes, remember this, they can also have like the same pattern as you do. Like they can have like a same pattern as you do on your board. Same thing on their board. They can have like the same pattern almost. So, but sometimes it could be different. And see, we won that. So, 
And remember, let's say if it's a chair, you're going to get the chair animation. I said there's a chair animation, there's a table animation, and there's a ladder animation. So you'll figure out which one is which. But of course, the two, two of them have a ladder and a table animation. So they're pretty much the same, pretty much, I think. But it's kind of hard to tell them apart. But said, so there's a piece in the corner. So you either have to go down this way or go sideways. You can't get, you can't go horizontal. You can't do that. You can only go, you can go left or down or yeah, you go right or down. Pretty much. That's how you can do that, which is really cool. But as I said before, the best way to do this is to go around is to go around in the board. That is where you want to go. Go around the square because that's pretty much where you're going to find them. Now, if a piece is like somewhere here, then it can also go into the middle. Usually the pieces are never in the middle. But let's say like a piece is like here. It kind of can make like a C or something. It could be like going this way. It can make it going like horizontal. So sometimes there's like a cool pattern that people do. You know what I mean? There's sometimes like a cool pattern. So there we go. We found a piece. Found one. Found a card. And remember, whenever it gets defeated, then it will show that it's defeated. You know what I mean? That means you defeated the card, which is cool. But since I didn't, I have to redo that again. And also, if let's say you find a chair piece, and if, uh, and if you find it, let's say that. So let's say you find a chair piece. Now remember, if you don't defeat the card... Um, it won't show you the chair animation. It will show you a different animation. But if it's a chair or a table, pretty much anything like that, um, it would just be the, the different animation. But let's say you find like the third piece for the ladder or the second piece for the table, it will show you the animation. Same thing if you find the chair, it will be the chair animation. Same thing on that. So that's how you can find those, of course, and that will give you the, at least the best odds on that. And um, I said he's going to win against me, which is... Pretty much what I figured. But also, so, but remember, whenever you have all four of these at the same time, it gives you better odds because you can actually fight everyone at the same time. And plus, they actually up the rewards too, which is nice. Um, also, remember, uh, let's say, uh, and remember, you only get, uh, you get uh, 24 hours to do this. If you don't, then you automatically forfeit the match. And you can actually save these packs too, just letting you guys know. If you guys didn't know that, you can actually save up these packs, which is cool. There's a simple trick on saving these packs. All you do is uh, just when, whenever you win the match, don't claim the pack or anything. And then we'll just go right to your mailbox, which is your uh, your reward tab. And that's where you can actually save it, which is really cool. I like that. I never knew that, but they but that's how you can actually do it, which is cool. Yeah, he's going to win. Oh, I missed. Now, as I said, that's the thing. Sometimes you got to figure, is it going left or is it going up? You know what I mean? That's the issue there, which I, that's not good. It's tough. I'll tell you that much. It's tough. Now, remember, also, whenever someone, like, whenever they have, like, a pattern of something, they could have, like, all the pieces in the middle. They could have, like, the ladder here, the table. They have they, they could have, like, the ladder here, the table, and the chair. Same thing with vice versa. It can go, like, up or down, left or It can go pretty much anywhere like that, So which is pretty cool. But it gives you the chance to win, which which is nice. I like that. Gives you at least a decent chance to win. There we go. We found the table. Now we just have to find the, the chair. Somehow, I still... If I didn't mess up those two times already, I maybe would have had a small chance of at least maybe getting a victory. Now, in order to get the bonus chance, you have to win. That is the only way to do it. So, And there's a few more tricks that I can show you guys as well. So there are a few more tricks. There we go. We found it. See? I said you can also random guess if you want to. So like you saw the pattern there, there was the there was the there was the ladder, there was the table. So what I did, it made it made it look like a C, and then I just went to straight. Because a lot of times you're pretty much going to find the chair in the corner pieces. That's pretty much where you're going to find them. But also they try to hide the chair as best they can because it's only one piece. So, and of course they could you could also have someone to let that that might just let you win. You know what I mean? And there's what you mainly get from the pack, just letting you go, letting you know, but you can get like a myth card or a bonus chance card if you're lucky. Yeah. And remember, as I said, if you guys want to start up another match, it takes four hours for a new match, but also you can spend 100 credits right away if you want to. Yep, yeah, that's how you can do that, which is really cool. But as I said, uh, remember, uh, you only have 24 hours to play the match. If you don't, then you automatically forfeit, or you can autom or you can forfeit the match to them and let them win. But sometimes if they don't play the match or they're just busy, they just forfeit the they just forfeit the match. But it said, I don't know if winning the match gives you, well, of course you have to win, 
But I wonder if they forfeit the match. I wonder if it gives you a better chance at actually maybe winning. You know what I mean? Like, I wonder if it gives you, like, a better chance at actually getting a big pull or something, you know? Because everything is always different, you know what I mean? Whenever they do something, for example. Like, I wonder if, like, if they forfeit the match, it gives you better pack odds, you know what I mean? I wonder if it does. See, there's a chair, right? See? There's the chair animation, see what I mean? I say, but remember, if you don't win, it doesn't show it, so. Now, if you do win the match, it does show it. There we go. I mean, finding the chair is definitely, like, really easy. I mean, here's what you could do. Let's say you don't win the match. You could just say, um, I said, if you don't win the match, you can literally just, like, face it, face the opponent again, or you can wait and just try to find the other pieces. But let's say you look around it, and the piece that you're on is the chair. You're just wasting all that time for nothing. So you can just leave it there for now and go look around. But it's up to you It's up to you guys if you, want, if you guys want to face the opponent again or go look for more of the obstacles. It's up to you. Up to you guys of what you want to do. It's how it's how you plan out your strategies of how you want to find all the pieces on the board. That's what makes TLC fun. It's kind of it's pretty much like Battleship, pretty much as if you guys didn't know. But I said it can give you some insane cards. And I said here are the rewards for like the table and stuff. If you guys didn't know, I mean these are just bonus prizes. So if you're just starting out, this is actually really helpful for everybody. So I would say now, of course, if you forfeit, you only get that. If you get defeated, this is what you get. Now, if you tie, you get at least a rarity pick, which I, which is really good. Now, of course, if you win, this is what you get for a win, which is nice. It gives you a bonus chance, which is going to be tough, but you can also get a rarity pick too, which is nice. But as I said, guys, that is how you can do this for TLC. I know it's tough. It's challenging, but it's a lot of fun. It lets you, and plus, remember, you can, you can play as many of these as you want. Now, of course, sometimes they'll have like 10 days, 20 days, 30 days, 40 days. The last time they had this, it was like a 30, 40 day event. Now, the first time it came out, it was like 40 days. It was awesome. Now, this is only 10 days, so they'll probably bring it out again. So we'll see how, but we'll see how long it takes for them to bring it out. I'm really hoping that they bring TLC out again later on, because so I really love this game. If you guys love this game, smash the like button. It is such a really good game. Like, it is such a good game mode to play. There's so many different strategies you can do. It's just, it's just so good. Now, of course, if you want to spend credits and speed it up a little bit, it's up to you guys and what you want to do. You can speed up the you can speed up the matches and actually get the matches quicker, or you can just go for it, like just wait for the matches. It's up it's up to you guys and what you guys want to do. For me, I have a little bit of credits I could spend it, but I kind of want to save it for other stuff. So there we go. We found the table. See what there's the table animation. I showed you guys the ladder, the chair, and the table animation. There are all three animations I showed you guys. And this is only two matches, but remember, it gives you four chances of bonus chance cards. And it's also kind of like Survivor, pretty much. It's kind of like you're trying to survive, I guess you could say. It's like Battleship combined with Survivor. <laughs> pretty cool. But I said, those are a lot of the tips and tricks that you can do. But I said, there's different possibilities. There's like different like different ways you can make your own board. It's up to you guys and what, however you guys want to make your own board. But I said, yep, pretty cool, huh? <laughs> I said, you want to try to put the pieces in where they don't think to look for them. You know what I mean? Sometimes if you find like a pattern, you think you know where the piece is, but they, they trick you on that. You know what I mean? It kind of it kind of makes you confused. You know what I mean? <laughs> but guys, as always, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you guys have, um, but but yeah, if you guys have enjoyed, make make sure make sure you guys smash 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 the smash the like button below. Hit hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. And if but it let guys know whenever I post a video. And as always, guys, remember um. Whenever, let's say, let's say the matches, let's say the events get ready to get done. Remember, play all four mat, have all four matches going at the same time. It'll make you tie, and you automatically get a rarity pick, which is really good. <laughs> Just letting you guys know that. But guys, always thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I hope everyone has a fantastic day. Hope everyone's doing good. And guys, let me know in the comments. Let me know if this video helped you guys out a little bit. Let me know. At least give you some ideas on some tips and tricks for the TLC, and pretty much how to get some big cards from it, like, like how to get like the big cards and stuff like that from it. Yeah. But guys, always thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I hope everyone has a fantastic day. I hope everyone's doing good, and I'll see everyone in the next video. Bye, guys. See you guys next time. Peace, peace, guys. Love you.